Hello and welcome back to channel T Lover. So if you are new to the channel, please subscribe to the channel and also do not forget to click on our bell icon for our latest update. Today also I am here with you bringing a new topic for you. And the topic of today is how you can get the free GitHub student pack without using the .edu mail. Okay. So in this video, we will discuss about how you can get the free GitHub student pack without using any .edu mails. If you want the GitHub student pack and if you are searching for how to get that student GitHub pack, then this video is very helpful for you. Do not skip any part of this game. And if you are totally new visitor on our channel, then please subscribe our channel and do not forget to click on our bell icon for our latest update. And I want to tell you that our channel provides you the free domain and hosting for your website. And if you have successfully got the website and YouTube channel, but you are not getting the traffic in this medium, then there are a lot of videos on my channel which will help you to get the free traffic for your website or YouTube channel. Okay. Besides this, if you have any problem related to monetization or adsense issue, then you can directly make a contact on tlover2054 in the Instagram that I I have shown in the screen also or else if you need any other social media platform then i have kept other platform in my blog so you can check out my blog link i'll provide this blog link in the description below so there are a lot of links so without wasting our time let's move for the today's content for the today's topic there are a lot of process to get the free edu pack so watch this video till the end okay so first of all you just go for the new tab and you have to type over your github student developer pack after that you can see the github student developer pack on the first link so just go for the first link so finally the github page has been opened over here after that you have to just go for the sign up for the student developer pack as you can see that option on the left screen so just click on that link finally a new page will be load over here and in this i always recommend you to go for with the student so after selecting your student you have to just click on the link below get student benefit now you need the username and password to login over here but if you do not have username and password you can simply create an account in this website so let's go for the create an account so here you have to choose a username email and password let's fill up this but before filling up this information you need the fake address over here so for that fake address you have to just go for the new tab and you have to type F A K E X Y and just go for the enter and after that a link will appear over here fake address generator now just click on the fake address generator and the interface will come like this so here you have to just go for the all countries now you scroll down and you can find the united state over here so just click on that united state so here we have successfully got the fake address of a person and it's of united states so let's look for his name so this is the name of that person we'll just copy this name now we'll just go for the github student pack and we'll just paste this username over here so we'll remove this surname and we'll add some digit over here so we have select our username let's move for the email address so you have to use your own email address here I have successfully submitted my email address now we will create a password over here after you have fill up the username email address and password just scroll down and you can find the verify your account here you have to solve the puzzle to verify yourself so just click on the verify finally we have successfully verified our account now we scroll down and we can just see the link create an account so just click on that create an account now you have to verify this gmail so for that you have to just go for the mail of your respective gmail so you'll receive the mail from github and you have to enter the code to verify this mail so this is our mail and as you see that we have received the mail from github so just click on this link and here you can find the code to verify your mail so just copy this code and paste in that github student pack so finally you will be redirected over here and you will be in the dashboard as you see that the student is already selected over here you have to just scroll down so here scrolling down you need the edu email or id card to verify yourself if you have edu mail then you can directly access this github student pack but if you do not have edu mail you can use the id card to verify yourself first of all you need the id card from any university or college to verify yourself so for that you have to just go for the canva.com where you can find a number of id card and you can create your own so you just go for the canva.com as this is my premium account so if you haven't got the premium account of this canva then you can just go for my video and scrolling down you can find the canva video where you can get the canva for your lifetime that is totally free and that is premium one so if you haven't got the premium canva then use this canva pro you can get the canva pro using this video so check out this video i have already took the premium version of this canva so i'll just go for the search and here i'll type student id card so this is the student id card i'll just click on it 
and we can find a number of id card in this canva.com where we can prove ourselves as a student okay so we have to just fill some of the information over here okay so scroll down you can choose any id card you may like so this is the pro id card i'll just click on this id card and i can customize this template so just click on the customize this template here you have to put the name of that fake address person so this is the name of that person copy this you can randomly create your id card number so we'll just copy the address also so we'll just go up and this is the address of that person will copy this one and we'll just paste in this template so you have to change this photo also so for that you have to just go for the app just go for the photos and here you have to type passport size photo so just click on this and you can find this number of photo in this canva.com okay so you can copy this all photos and you can paste over there okay now to make change on your photo just drag these photos and paste like this you can adjust this photo just clicking double on this photo we have successfully fill up this detail after you have successfully fill up this information and photos you have to just upload your university logo so for that you have to just go for the new tab and here you have to type for the santa fe college and when you click on the image you can find a number of logo for this now you have to again go for the canva dot and on the upload option on the left screen you have to just go for the upload now select your respective university logo before we apply for the logo we'll just delete this template logo again you have to just go for the photos on the right screen and just go for the barcode now select this barcode and drop in this id card so you can adjust this barcode like this so finally our student id card is ready on this field okay so we'll just click on this here and you have to download this id card now again we'll go for the github student pack and here you have to select your respective mail now in the school name you have to just type this university name so copy this university name now you can see the santa fe college over here so select this santa fe college and you can write your plan over here so you can use any plan over here you can write your own words on this text box so write the proper use of this github on this text box just click on the continue to continue so finally we are on the next page where we can upload the id card of that person okay so before uploading your id card we have to just click on the vpn and you have to select the united state vpn over here so just select your united state vpn if this website asks you for the location during this process then you have to already use the vpn to access this site okay so do not forget to use the vpn as a united state and here you can upload the id card but there is no upload option on this id card so i have solution for it also you got the upload option then you can directly click on the upload option and you can upload the id card but if you do not have that upload option then you can use this method okay so for that you have to use the software now you can see the software as obs studio so just open the software so this is the software if you haven't downloaded the software you can just find the link in the description below or you can just go for the web and you can type obs studio download it's totally free and you do not have to crack the software also okay so you can directly install this software and you can download from this official website and in the source you have to click right on the mouse and click on the add and you have to add the image over here so just click on the image now just click on the browse to browser id card we have kept that id card in the download so we'll just select this id card this is our id card we have just created we'll just click on the ok now we'll adjust the resolution for this id card finally if you select the id card resolution you have to just click on the start virtual camera on the right screen now you have to just go for the github student pack so this is the id card uploading section so just click on the take photo in the id card you have to always use the expiring date so just click on the text and add the text bottom in your id card finally we have updated the expired date on our id card so we'll just click on the download again now we'll just go for the github student pack and we'll just click on the take a picture so you have to just click on the allow to use your camera as you have successfully started virtual camera your id card will be detected like this when your id card is detected you have to just click on the take a photo they have told that we have successfully uploaded our photo they have successfully uploaded our photo and we have to just go for the proceed my application to get this github student pack so just click on the proceed my application so they are pre-checking our id card it will take time to reload this page just wait for it as it will be 100 percent you will be redirected to the next page okay If you got the reject on the first attempt as I got, 
then you have to just again go for the same process again to upload this id card now your process is in the review so it will take three days to get the student developer pack for this github okay so this is how you can upload the id card and you can use the student id card this is how you can get the github student developer pack without using the edu mail just by using the id card over here okay so this is how you can get the free student id card and you can upload in this github student pack to get the github student developer pack okay so without using any dot edu mail so if you like the video please hit on the like option do not forget to click on the subscribe and bell icon for our latest update and if you have got any problem and confusion regarding this topic or any topic then you can directly make a contact on till over 2054 in the instagram there are a lot of useful content on my channel please go through these videos if you need the canva pro account then there is a video for getting the canva free account over here and if you need the edu mail also then there is video for that edu mail thanks for watching this video till our official channel like share and subscribe will value our support thank you